Yeah. It was talking about like Rikers Down in the 80s. They got all these like little certain like, you know, everything up on YouTube. And you like Rikers Down? Yo, let's talk about it, man, because I'm going to tell you. We had Harlem, Brooklyn, Queens, Staten Island, you know, the BX, everybody on the island, everybody going through the tombs, everybody going through certain, you know, however they got transported to the island or however it went. So, like I said, man, it was like, I'm going to tell you, that shit was like a fucking resort, man. That shit was like a fucking old folks home, man. Like, if you got raped or some shit like that, nigga, you had your ass up on the gate telling nigga to come fuck you. Because on the island, this shit was serious, man. You know, like, niggas was coming, people was coming in from that jail getting money in the streets. If you get money in the streets, everybody knew who you was. No matter where you was from, Brooklyn, Queens, or whatever, everybody knew you. So you go in... See something from anywhere, anywhere. You know all your peoples. They got everything on lock. You know, yo, 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 cuzzo, cuzzo, cuzzo. So when the blocks you, they like, oh, nah, yeah, that's them. And them. My name is Lester. So that name was far like, nah, he, 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 he the type of cat like, he'll rip you, but not even just rip you, but he got everybody, his whole team. Then he got the guards, then. They got the Muslim thing, like, so nobody, like, trying to really be even close to me, like, you know what I'm saying? But that was since I was a kid, like, you know what I'm saying? So, I done been to prisons all across from here to New York, all the way across the West Coast, you know? And if I was with the Mexicans, I'm like, yo, I got some, like, yo, what y'all doing? Do y'all got the lessons? Do y'all really kings? We build... We locked down the whole yard. Crips and Bloods is like, oh, that's the God. And he, Crips and Bloods all rolling together like we all rolling together. Yeah, they had to get me out of that place, man. Like, they, this dude, like, wherever he go, he lock it down because, man, it's just all about communication. You know? I came up with the, the most richest rap in the world. That's Jay-Z. He be like, yo, the God. Yo, what's up, B? I'm like, hey, come on, man. <laughs> you know, I, I, I ain't wearing none of that shit. And Jay like, yo, you gotta stop that bullshit. Hey, come on, B. But you know, my nigga. But I'm just saying how we came up. We came up around real money, man. I was 14, 13. We counted hundreds of thousands of dollars, man. That's what taught me how to count the money. You know, and then I was just a good young dude. Everybody that was a, a fiend or an addict, I don't even want to call them that, but was probably doing their thinking how I always made sure they was in the right position to do what they wanted to do. And that go a long way. Some mad people love you. You know what I'm saying? They like, yo, you know what? Oh, that's my nigga. I had to change that name from Lester to God, like, because they like, oh, Lester's, his name was related to, like, yeah, they just, like, if Norby Hager said up there with Biggs, he's like, yo, oh, Hall of Max, they're a gang. And, and, and Biggs is like, hell no, they ain't no fucking gang. But no, like, they're a fucking gang. No, 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 they're not a gang. But they will fucking tie your ass up, like, you know. I don't know how you want to consider that. And it'd be, it be this nigga by itself or be that nigga by itself. Them niggas don't roll like me. Them niggas just do how they do. How nice. Mm, that's why the industry, like, you know, like, oh, look at them niggas' records. Yeah, yeah, them niggas, yeah, them niggas live it. 